Hello and welcome to a Camsys Magic Q tutorial. This one will be uh, creating a test rig and yeah, that's basically it. Uh, we'll use it to dive <laughs> dive deeper into the functions and uh, so on. So we won't cover any features in depth. Uh, I'll do that later. And it, but if you got any questions, feel free to ask, and I'll try to respond with a video. So we'll, we'll just create the rig. Uh, uh, quickly. So to start a new show, go to setup, new show, and these are just uh, default settings. Select normal. To patch heads, go to patch, view heads, choose head. I'm gonna type Ayrton and then magic panel, uh, panel FX, and that's the one. I'm gonna click that. And I'm going to choose the extended mode with the elements, duplicated elements, so we can pixel map and do some fun stuff. I'm going to choose that one. I'm going to patch nine of those because I'm going to, I'm going to do a create a nine by nine grid. And go to preview view light so we can see what's going on. I'm going to select those heads. I'm going to in patch. I'm going to go to view this. I'm going to go to attach objects. I'm going to insert a room to get a control of the size of the room. I'm going to make that 15 by 10 by 5. That's enough for a moment. Go to selected heads or this heads. And I'm going to zero the position. I'm going to rotate. Uh, rot Okay, so let's play some first. Uh, the first ones are going to be at, let's say, three, two, and one. Now I'm going to adjust all of their positions by dragging them up. And I'm going to go to, let's take 3.25. And I'm going to type in. Um, minus 7.3 so they move backwards towards the wall and then in the x position I'm going to take the first three type minus 1 through 1 and that places them in a row from minus 1 in the x dimension to 1 and currently I think these are in meters which is handy I'm gonna do the same for these ones. These ones, so minus one through one, and then minus one through one. And there we go. Now we're gonna patch some more heads. Go to view heads, choose head, and if you use this search function, you get a. You can search. It's an advanced search function, so you can type the name of the model directly, for instance. So let's say sharp. Search it, and we see all the brands that has fixture names Sharpie. We'll go to clay packing Sharpie, and choose the standard mode. Then patch it, and we're gonna create a four by four grid this time. So we're gonna patch sixteen heads, and we're gonna do the same thing. For, we're gonna place those as well. So let's go to. All right, yeah, I forgot something. Go to magic panel. Uh, and we're gonna rotate them by minus 90 degrees. That allows, since we're going to, going to pixel map those and do some fun stuff regarding that, uh, we mostly want them facing forwards, which also allows us to do a 2D movement with pan. Now select your sharpies, go back here, uh, I'm gonna zero of those and let's take minus 7.3 to those as well we can type 4 3 2 and 1 and we're going to do the same uh, thing that we did with uh, with the uh, magic panels we're going to type minus 1.5 through 1.5 
So we get this line of four. The same thing for the rest. And minus 1.5 through 1.5. Now there we go. Looks nice. Uh, or looks nice, I guess. The correct ground. There we go. To save this, you go to Setup, Save Show, and we're gonna type t Tutorial Rig. And we're gonna press Enter or Return, which will save it as a, an SH, it, <laughs> SHW file. That's it for uh, this tutorial. We will now create a test rig or a basic rig. Uh, which we will have some fun with. So uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.